Hey, 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 dear Swissies. I am in a totally different area today. It's very cold, it's very windy, but I think you will love it. Um, it is a kind of inspiration for you, uh, maybe for your next trip to Switzerland. And it is called St. Peters Insel in Erloch. So let's go. On this island, there is a hotel and a restaurant but uh, they have closed now and they open on 24th of March and I think I will check it out. <laughs> it looks a little bit like walking in, uh, <coughs> in Africa. Huh? So maybe I will see some lions here. I don't think so. The only lion we have here <laughs> is Rasta and he has to be on the leash because it is a nature protecting zone. Yeah, that's, that's why he's on the leash, sniffing everywhere. Oh, I am quite sure it must be lovely in spring and summer here. Huh? There's surely many birds here living. You know, Switzerland is not only Bernays Oberland, but I have to be honest. It is, of course, one of the most beautiful parts in Switzerland, but there are so many other lovely places which I also don't know or do not visit because I already live in paradise. But uh, yeah, I will try to show you more other places this year. Okay, I promise. It looks like people are living here, but I am not sure if they live here or if the houses are only for vacation. But imagine they live here, huh? And then you say, hey, I live in Switzerland. And then you say, and I live on an island in Switzerland. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's not that bad, huh? Yeah, I guess these are Wild geese, goose geese. Yeah, it remembers me to the story of Niels Holgersson. You know the story? Niels Holgersson, flieg mit den Gänsen davon. Yeah, it's maybe a European story, I don't know. Yeah. They're having a party up there. Oh, this is a creepy part. Huh? And then you see the moving trees like silent giants over your head. I am quite sure that this part will be overcrowded in spring. Yeah, but now we are totally alone. Yeah, I saw one car moving, but that's all. <laughs> I've just read that it is a nature protecting zone from national importance. Yeah, and it belongs to the canton of Bern. Yes, and as you can see in summer, you can reach this island also by boat. There must be a pavillon over there from where you should have a great view over the lake. Okay, can we go Gixla? Did you know lately a statistic came out about the tourism in Switzerland? And last year we had almost the same amount of tourists in Switzerland. It was only 3% less as in uh, 2019. Crazy, huh? And the people don't want to go uh, to do the thing with Europe, you know, and all the, the cities. They want to go to Switzerland and they want to stay here in Switzerland about two or three weeks. Yeah, and I can fully understand them because yeah, if you want to see the whole beauty of Switzerland, 
it needs some time. So it makes me wonder how this year will be. Uh, this is the pavillon over there. Huh? I, I only know pavillons when I grew up in Zurich. Yeah. And I think people misunderstood the meaning of pavillon. Uh, they just drank their alcohol there. But yeah, this is city, you know. On the countryside, it is of course a little bit different. And they do some violins, concerts or similar things here, I'm quite sure. I saw that there must be a beach there. Uh-huh, yeah. I think this is finally the moment that Rasta can play a little bit. He's already in, Woo, almost. <laughs> yeah, 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 I'm coming, I'm coming. Ah, oh, Rasta. Yeah, looks good, Rasta, looks good, just a minute. Just wait, 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 hey, wait, look me up, wee, yeah, you can go in, watch it, <laughs> Finally, yeah, can go spiele. It's okay here. <laughs> Happy. Wow, I I just saw it right now. That uh, these are um, muscles. Yeah, all this with an hand are muscles. It was totally Russell's part. He loves the waves. Yeah, and he loves to move the stones all the time. Yeah, that's why his teeth are so bad. But yeah, fun first, girl. <laughs> this is now the hotel I was talking about at the beginning. And it is not only a hotel, it's a kloster. What's the name of kloster in English? Uh, where they do uh, sing hallelujah every day or maybe in the morning and evening <laughs> yeah so this is the Gloucester and uh, also a hotel and normally um, building like this or institutions like this they also produce local stuff local cheese local bread yeah so maybe they do the same but I don't know maybe we'll find it out in spring if they are dog friendly yeah, and if they are not dog friendly, we just go into the early morning to check out how it looks like. Yeah. Oh, we have some Rindley here. Look. Yeah, yeah. I told you that they probably produce their own cheese. Yeah. I hike now this path one way <laughs> to way back, and I have to say this is quite boring. Because it's only really, you have this possibility, yeah, just uh, walking on the road. Yeah, this is maybe one thing not, not that funny. But I'm not sure if they have a, a shuttle bus 
in, in summer. I don't know, but to walk just on this road, it's, ah, I don't know. <laughs> he joined us. <laughs> and it, it is not only 10 minutes. Gal, one way is one hour and 10 minutes. So yeah, you are around on this trip for about three hours if you want to join something. Yeah, yeah, baby. Yeah, and I saw that on the street, or on the road, it is allowed to uh, let the dog off the leash. Yeah, no animals on the road, normally. 